All right, here you have a big announcement that's coming from Karnataka Sidramaya now, the new Chief Minister of the State, D.K. Shivkumar, who's now the Deputy Chief Minister with an internal understanding that there is a, a power sharing pact. D.K. Shivkumar will be taking the second after the term, but it's an announcement that the Congress has kept very close to their chest. That revelation hasn't yet happened publicly, but this is what we hear from our highly placed sources that D.K. Shivkumar has been pacified by giving him a deputy chief minister, KPCC presidency, as well as the second half of the term, along with plum portfolios like home. I'm going to cut across uh, to the images that came in right from the start of the day that showed all that animosity and, and the, you know, the build up towards who exactly was going to be named the Chief Minister of Karnataka. After much of that uh, initial confusion that it's going to be D.K. Shivkumar uh, and Sidramia sharing the term, uh, it appears that the Congress party decided to announce only Sidramia's name as the Chief Minister. They did not mention about a sharing pact. And they also very clearly said that D.K. Shivkumar will act as a deputy and he will work shoulder to shoulder with Sidramia. And under Sidramia's guidance, D.K. Shivkumar and Sidramia will, uh, will ensure well for the state of Karnataka and ensure all the promises of guarantees that they have made in the state will be delivered. In fact, this kind of uh, the, the split between the two leaders uh, in the run-up to this announcement was evident. D.K. Shivkumar, Sidramaya were digging in their heels. Both of them accepted nothing less than a chief minister's post. And finally, the Congress has come up with a formula and almost three days after deliberations finally revealed it through a press conference. I'm going to cut across all those reactions where you had Randeep Surjewala, K.C. Venukopal very clearly stating Siddharamya, the next Chief Minister for Karnataka. Listen in. Bhai, Bharat ki janta ko bhi batana padega, Randeep ji, kya wo formula tha jo aap log ne jisse khaka tayyar kiya? Adhaniya Khadge sahab ko apna zindagi ka lamba tazarba hai. Unhe zindagi mein kis prakar se us lambe tazarbe ke aadhar par किस प्रकार से प्रांत की प्रगति और तरक्की हो इसकी इसका तरीका उन्हें आता है और उसके आधार पे उन्होंने निर्णय कर दिया हमने केवल वो निर्णय आपको बताया है ये कहा गया आपने कहा कि दोनों लोग रेस में थे और उसके बाद राय शुमारी के बाद सीधा रमैया आगे निकल गया जी नहीं राय शुमारी जो है उसका आधार कंसेंसस बिल्डिंग है एक मॉडल पूरा देश देख रहा है मोदी जी का है जहाँ डिक्टेटरशिप से बात थोपी जाती है एक मॉडल सोनिया गांधी जी का राहुल गांधी जी का प्रियंका गांधी जी का खड़गे साहब का कांग्रेस का है जहां राय शुमारी इसलिए होती है कि एकता बने प्रदेश को ताकत मिले लोगों को ताकत मिले और कंसेंसस बने यूनैनिमिटी बने और यूनिटी पे हो और मुझे लगता है कि कांग्रेस ने एक बार फिर ये करके दिखाया है सर ये जानना सब लोग चाहते हैं कि जो आप लोग की स्वेरिंग इन सेरेमनी होगी क्या उसमें विपक्षी नेता भी शामिल होंगे बाकी लोग को बुलाएंगे और एक शक्ति प्रदर्शन के तौर पर इसको देखेंगे 2024 के हम कोई शक्ति प्रदर्शन नहीं करेंगे हम केवल अपने आप को कर्नाटक के लोगों के आगे नतमस्तक होकर उनकी सेवा में शीश झुकाएंगे हाँ जो सहयोगी दल हैं या जो हमारे मुख्यमंत्री गण हैं या और मित्र दल हैं वो जरूर आएंगे क्योंकि ये लड़ाई केवल कर्नाटक की नहीं ये लड़ाई प्रजातंत्र और संविधान की भी है सोनिया गांधी ने डीके शिव कुमार से बात की उनको मनाने की कोशिश की ऐसी बात है। आप सबने सबसे बात की और ये उसका परिणाम है टू कन्वे हिस्स डिसीजन कांग्रेस प्रेसिडेंट डिसीजन टू द मीडिया to through the media to the people of karnataka and the nation he decided to make sidaramaya as the chief minister of karnataka we are having a clp meeting in the evening at bangalore to formally elect clp leader 20th day after tomorrow 12:30 is there swearing in ceremony along with the chief minister and deputy chief minister a group of ministers also will be sworn in that day 